four unusual ideas for holiday reading. What to read this Christmas? The Christmas holidays are the best time to disconnect from everyday stress. To relax and connect with your family, catching up on events missed. This festive atmosphere can be greatly enhanced by a little reading, seated comfortably on the couch in front of the fireplace. Get the most out of it by trying one or more of our unusual ideas for holiday reading. Please subscribe to our channel and like this video if you find it useful. 1. Read your journals. Keeping a journal can be done in many ways. You can write down notes and quotes from books you read. You can put on paper the problems you're facing and the possible solutions. You can capture important moments of your life. Whatever you write in it is the best picture of who you are as a person now and how you evolve through time. Jim Rohn once said that the best gifts you can leave to your children and grandchildren are your journals, your pictures, and the books you read. This way they can get to really know you. Imagine what a joy it would be if you had that gift from your great grandmother. The same way your journals will be beneficial to you if you read them. As it happens, many people write in a journal, but few read them later. Going through your own notes helps you see yourself from a different perspective, as an outside person. You get to know things about yourself that you couldn't see when you were on the spot. When emotions have long been settled, you get to be critical and ready to learn the lessons. You also get to see how you've grown and give yourself credit. What better thing to read on Christmas than a story of your life? 2. Read your goals from the past year or years. Many of us start the year by setting new goals and checking off the old ones. We close one period and start the next one with fresh hopes and plans for the future. This is an important process that enables personal empowerment and gives us a sense of accomplishment. What is even more important though is reading our goals from the past year and studying the progress we made on them. What got done? what did not, and why. Thinking about that, or even better, writing a page-long summary of the year, is a great way to close the door to the past, to leave a lasting memory, and learn from mistakes made. One of the best things to read during the holidays is your goals from the past few years, if you keep a record. During this sentimental time of the year, joined by your family, you can take a walk through your recent past and better appreciate it. It can also spark your creativity for the goal setting for the next year. 3. Read newspapers from the time you were born. Visit the local library and search for news and articles from the years of your early childhood. It's always interesting to read about the past, especially if it's closely related. Learn about the economic conditions of your country, state, and town. About the political systems around the globe. About scientific inventions at the time. Put yourself in the shoes of your parents, raising a kid at the time. This will bring you closer with your family and lead to beautiful conversations around the dinner table. 4. Read children's books. These days, people are so hyped about productivity that the main thing they read is personal development books and professional literature. But reading a fiction book or an adventure book can also be greatly beneficial. Reading a children's book is fun. It's engaging. It sparks our imagination and brings us back to the time when everything was possible and grand and beautiful. Rereading a great children's book years later is an enthralling experience that makes you reminisce about old times. It can make you feel younger altogether. Thank you for watching, and if you enjoyed our reading ideas, please share it with us in the comment section below. We appreciate your feedback. Tell us in the comments what is your favorite book. Can't get enough of reading? Find us on Facebook at facebook.com slash readandgrow1 and also on Twitter at twitter.com slash readandgrow1.